do you think of the invasive African jewelfish? You're only asking this probable cause because you know I got an attitude about it. They're one of the few truly destructive invasives. There are not many, and I'm talking Florida here. There are not uh, uh, aquatic-wise. There probably are no more than two or three invasive fish that are destructive. <clears throat> there are a number of others, but they are in niches that are not competing substantially with native species, so-called so called native species. So the whole argument about invasives is a specious argument. It ignores the reality of what invasive really means because it means any fish that was not created by God in that, or evolved in that specific body of water. And that includes pretty much everything. Pretty much. There isn't much that evolved in any body of water from 200 million years ago to today that can be genuinely referred to as native. And in point of fact, the Florida Wildlife Commission defines a native species as any that has lived in Florida waters for a minimum of 100 years. From 1920 forward, anything that was in that water from 1920 and earlier is considered native. Now, that's 100 years. So in the year 3000, anything that is in the water in Florida now, in the year 2000, will be considered native. Think about that for a minute. That'll blow your mind. What does that have to say about invasive species? Dyslexia kicking in. <laughs> Did I catch him? Did you catch him? What do you think happened during the mighty flood? There you go. There you go. Good point, Marines. And if anybody thinks that's purely biblical, you haven't studied geography. Because geography demonstrates that uh, within the last million years, there's been global flooding, substantial global flooding. What does that do to native species? You don't think snakeheads are? Here's the thing about snakeheads. There are somewhat something like 14 different species of snakeheads. Two, maybe three of them are potentially destructive invasive species. The rest are not. They only get that big, four to six inches, full grown. A dozen of the species of that family are dwarfs. All of them are bad. That is fundamental ignorance. It is legislation based on stupidity.